It's been hacked oh, since wow. Friday. And they wow. del- and they deleted like twelve other just like random posts. They changed my cover photo, which I was able to change back before I got kicked off of it. Dude, yeah, like two, just a random black dude doing push-ups. Good job. Yeah. You're pressing your butt. Yo, what up, guys? It's Gary Vee, and it's time for the Daily Bread. Give us our daily bread. I want the whole basket. Because I'm a hustle till I get it or I'm in a casket. Passionate for providing value in every way. Not cashing in for providing value every day. Paying it forward. Right thing, I'll do it till I'm dead. I hope you're hungry because it's time for the daily bread. We've got a lot of stuff going on today. Um, you got a call at 11.30 with Sina Azari going over more finalized plans for the event that we're going to host with him out in um, Irvine, California. I got a 1 p.m. call with Jeff Castillo, Digital Jeff, to finalize some plans for filming on Friday uh, with Gerard. Podcast at 4. I think I may have another podcast in there, in between there with Nehemiah. Um, I got a bunch of scheduling stuff I got to finish out for the next three weeks worth of business to write on the insurance side. And then we got to finalize our plans on recording with Gerard and kind of the format. I got to write out some questions and really get that dialed in. So if I send him 300 uh, Ask Gary V books, as you can tell, I'm a fan of that book. Um, I sent him 300 of them um, over the last few months uh, to use for his community, and I'm pretty sure they're just sitting in a box uh, somewhere at their location. So I was going to ask him if he wants to do, maybe do like a Facebook Live, Instagram Live kind of giveaway contest thing. One cool thing I mentioned real quick. Um, so the girl that won the contest that we did to give away the Gary Vaynerchuk signed book, Crushing It. She got it in the mail, and how cool is this? She sent Gary an email, but it was addressed to Gary and me, which is pretty awesome. Um, And she said, Gary and Tyler, I'm writing you today just incredibly thankful for the good people you are. I I have really drawn a lot of influence from the both of you since I started my journey towards earning a PhD in August. You two really are leaders of tomorrow's world today. I aspire to keep taking everything I learned from you and apply it to my world here in agriculture, agricultural economics. Just the happiest girl in the world now, thanks to this opportunity through this book, uh, Jessica Richard. And um, I just thought that was like so cool uh, that she did that. Um, and just like crazy to like even be mentioned in the same sentence. like. Tyler and Gary, like you and Gary, like what you guys have done. Regardless, uh, that was cool. And so that literally got sent to Gary like 30 minutes after I sent him an email asking if I could stop by VaynerMedia to grab a quick uh, photo. So anyways, um, it is pouring down rain outside. We've got a bunch of stuff to do and uh, not a lot of time to do it. So we're going to get started. I can't even I can't even get on it no it's been hacked since Friday literally they deleted like episode 17 19 21 22 23 24 and that's it of, of the daily vlog and like they left everything else on there like it doesn't make any sense so but it looks like I'm but good for you good for you though because that, that this, this incident it's just gonna give you more material and content material and content to like yeah. you know blow up again like it's like one step back or two steps forward it's pretty good Oh yeah, dude, it's all, it's all good. Hello? What up, Hefe? Hey, 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 how we doing? I'm good, man, how are you? So I'm supposed to, I think I've got like 12.30 p.m. to 3 blocked off with Gerard. And okay. And what I really wanted to do with it was I wanted to basically interview the two of you together mm-hmm. and kind of make it like, a, you know, obviously leaders create leaders um, that you guys have done, kind of flip it, kind of flip the script on it and just have you guys talk about this experience and traveling and, and uh, interviewing all these incredible entrepreneurs and you can, I'm sure there's some cool stories and things like that, but 
kind of make it to where, you know, I'm kind of interviewing both you guys together. Does that make sense? Yeah, it makes sense. Definitely. Do you think, do you think G would be down with that? He's really, really good about you know, stuff like that. You guys can certainly use the footage for anything you need to use it. If you, if you, if you need to use it for anything, uh, we can get you all the raw footage later on too. Perfect. So. Yeah, perfect. Yeah. At all. But it's like, it's a little different when you have successful business people that kind of leading the whole thing. I agree 100%. That, that's kind of what I wanted to do with that Motivation Kings page that I have was eventually kind of, kind of molded into this, um, you know, you could be like the king of real estate the, and there could be a king of yeah. finance, king of health, king of fitness, king of, you know, all these different, different fields. And then you could literally have like an annual King's Conference where you bring them all into one place and they everyone speaks in their whatever their respected fields of expertise. This is the Breadwinner Podcast. I am your host, Tyler Harris, and I am uh, extremely uh, happy to have a guest on the uh, podcast today. Uh, goes by the name Reezy. I asked him right before we got on here, man. I was like, "Hey, you want me to say your full no- name?" And he said, "Nope, it's Reezy." And so that I love that. Uh, <laughs> but I'm gonna let him come on here, give you a little bit of uh, intro to who he is. But I can just tell you, just off of his Instagram, says over four million dollars in lifetime Amazon sales. And I, man, I love this line right here: "From food stamps to freedom." So we'll let him give a chance to uh, introduce himself, let everybody know you who you are. Uh, Reezy, man, appreciate you being on the podcast. Hey, thanks for having me, Tyler. Appreciate it, man. So, um, you got me, yeah? Yes, sir. We're good. Um, so, um, I grew up super poor, food stamps, uh, divorced parents, foster care at times, uh, parents in jail, prison, drug addicted, and um, I just didn't have a lot growing up, right? I, I lived in hotels, I was homeless at times. And so at a very young age, I learned how to hustle and how to make my own way. Make it rain. Make it rain down. All right, man. Well, I appreciate you being on. I appreciate you uh, being transparent and telling, and telling the real story because that's, that's the only kind of people I want on this podcast are people that are transparent, are actually giving you the, the real story and are actually providing value to this world, man. So I appreciate you being on. And uh, with that, guys, that is the Breadwinner Podcast. I'm your host, Tyler Harris. And if you have not done so yet, please go to iTunes, subscribe to Breadwinner Podcast, and make sure that you leave a review when you do. We'll see you next time. <laughs>